Well, thank you very much. I just want to... Specifically, in one case, I asked uh, about the uh, leader of the Taliban operating inside Pakistan, apparently freely, Mr. Hakimi, who was publicly declaring uh, his uh, pride at the role of the Taliban in the assassination of a British citizen. I'm delighted to say that uh, while I was still there, I was told that uh, Mr. Hakimi had been arrested. I welcome that. Um, so I think we've come a long way in getting a united front against terrorism, but there is no stopping at 50%. We're either 100% against terrorism or we're not. Indeed, on a global scale, where we not only support India's uh, candidature for membership of the United Nations Security Council, but stand completely with India in our opposition to all forms of terrorism everywhere it may arise. We have experience of this in our own countries and territories, in Northern Ireland for many decades, in Kashmir, in the case of India. But now we face together a, a phenomenon that's on a global scale. And the UK was one of the first countries to arms supplies.